How's it going, everyone? All right, so uh, what you saw in the title is uh, it's correct. I'm not going to give you any bullshit, and it's going to be really straight to the point. I'm going to show you guys how you can record gameplay off of your PlayStation without a capture card. So um, just get straight into it. We're going to do this. I'm going to show you what you need. You're going to need this Streamlabs OBS, and you're going to need this remote play for your PlayStation. You're going to also need to go into your settings on remote play and make sure remote play is enabled in your, you know, settings. So with that being said, both the links will be in the description if you need to get to those quick if you don't have them. <clears throat> now, real quick, you'll go into remote play, you'll log in, you'll set it all up to where it looks like this. Give it a second. It'll look like this for you. As when you're here and you can access your settings and stuff like that, you're good to go. When you're in Streamlabs OBS, you're going to need to download it. You're going to need to make sure everything's good and you'll need to sign in with Twitch. It doesn't matter if you're not trying to make a Twitch, you know, stream happen. The whole point is that you get to where it looks like this. You need to get to a screen where it shows this. All right. You'll need to go into your scenes. You'll create a scene. Okay, and then you'll go into the sources and you'll create a source called uh, Window Capture. Window Capture will capture any specific window. I'll put the pictures on the screen. Um, things you need to know, things you might have questions for. Um, the settings for the Window Capture are going to be popped up right here. They should be already on the screen. You're going to want it to look like that, if not similar. Now, um... I'm going to get out of here and once you uh, once you have that up <clears throat> you're going to have this you have you're going to have window up in uh Streamlabs and you're going to activate let's go ahead and uh hit properties it'll have a window similar to this you're going to want to hit the window and you're going to want to select the uh spe specified window which happens to be remote play um when it is open you're going to select that and it's going to, you know, pop up on the screen like this. All right. You'll have remote play up here. And once you have a stable connection to your remote play and it's connected to your PlayStation and it's showing up, you can screen capture it with this. Now at the bottom right, right here, where it says record is where you can record videos. There's a bunch of settings in there, which I recommend y'all all should definitely thoroughly learn how and what they mean and what they do rather and how to work them. So get that out of the way real quick it, it's super easy as long as you take your time and you're you're very understanding so once you do that you can connect to remote play you'll have window capture here and you can have it on have your playstation running through remote play and have it popped up on your screen here where you can record it just like i'm doing right now so if you have any questions that should be it should be as easy as that now, if you have any questions, just leave them in the comments and I'll get to them as soon as possible. I'll answer them to my best extent. I hope this was very helpful for you guys. Y'all have a nice day. Again, if you have any questions, just put it down below. I usually do gameplay videos as my first tutorial, so <laughs> whatever. Um, give it a like, give it a subscribe. I'll see y'all guys next time.